day. Previous form gives us some hope. Orlando's give 14 into 11. They straighten up. We're set. And we're away. Best away was Hal Spitfire. Easily got across uh, the favourite fairy tale hall. She's gone up into a gallop, so that very short quote is not good for her. And also making a mistake in the early stages was Muscle Tony. We got trotting quickly and goes past fairy tale hall. Our Spitfire out in front leads the way and leads by a full sulky's length. In second place, in getting into its slipstream is Orlando's Gift and a margin of around about 12, 15 metres away to Ghent. Maybe 10 metres now. He's making ground quickly. A further 20 metres away behind those was Regal Assassin. Muscle Tonian's 15 metres behind it. And Fairy Tale Hall was a further 15 metres behind him. In the front straight, our Spitfire leads away. She'll probably go a lot better tonight. She's out in front, leads by a full sulky's length, not breaking any records, going at a slow tempo. Orlando's Gift is second, and Ghent is third. A margin then of around 12 metres to Regal Assassin. Latching onto its back was Muscle Tonian, then in turn at about 10 metre gap, then to Fairytale Hall. Starting to fill the gaps with his slower tempo up in front. Lead time 51.8. They head towards where they started. They've completed the first circuit. And out in front, it's our Spitfire. They have full sock his length. In second placing is Orlando's Gift. Third placing five metres away. At uh, this stage, staying on the inside was Ghent. Here comes Gator with Muscle Tony, and now moving forwards, being well supported, and goes up strongly to go and face the breeze. Fairy Tale Hall is going to latch onto its back. Regal Assassin didn't want that option. It goes back the last placing. Lead time comfortable, 51.8. First quarter, 32.6. And our Spitfire brings him into the front straight. Muscle Tony and outside the leader. Now gets within three metres of the leader. And on the inside is Orlando's gift. And the leader travels OK. Muscle Tony and likewise travelling OK on a firm rein. One out, one back uh, is Ghent, who was able to pop off from the inside. But, but just being niggled out there. On the inside, Regal Assassin and Fairy Tale Hall at the tail end of the field. Towards the 700, second quarter, 29.8, 62.4. And in front, it's our Spitfire. Leads by four metres. Muscle Tony in second. Orlando's Gift struggling to keep the leaders back. Gents under pressure. Held up on the inside, Regal Assassin and Fairy Tale Hall at the tail end of the field. Brown had a look left and right on the leader. And it's our Spitfire in front with 450 to go. Leads by four metres, going as good as anything. In second, placing on the outside, trying hard is Muscle Tony. is starting to rise to the the occasion getting into the clear regal assassin is now running on so all of a sudden he comes on the scene as well 29 7 for the third quarter our spitfire can she hold on muscle tony is four meters away our spitfire got away she's in front by six meters now trying hard regal assassin on the inside orlando's gift and muscle tony and just in front of those but our spitfire is going to lead all of the way he's down on the line second on the inside orlando's gift third was very tight out wide regal assassin or Muscle Tony and behind those fairy tale hall and Ghent was around 20 metres away at the tail end of the field.